guys welcome to another video so a very quick one um, just taking possession of a PE box for the TR99 the first one I've had in I don't know 10 or 12 years um, but this is a disc controller card it came without the case now the issue this has it's not recognized I think it is a problem with this power regulator here uh, I don't have one on, in stock but I've ordered one so over the weekend I'll be doing a little video of replacing this regulator and seeing if the card works, if there's any life in the card at all really if not um, well they should be really, I don't see why it wouldn't work seems fairly straightforward it's a busy little board but it's all straightforward stuff um, it has two floppy connectors, one internal one external uh, it's a standard Texas Instruments I think it's a single sided single density or it might be a variation of that but you can upgrade it to double sided double density I think uh, but that is something to look forward to in the future uh, what I will be doing is probably connecting a GoTech to this and uh, sticking in some disk images and I'm um, just having a bit of mess about with the TI-99, all good fun. So anyway, it's just a short video from me. Um, what this card does when you plug it in, the light doesn't come on, this little LED, and any peripheral software says the card isn't connected. So obviously it just, well, there's nothing. Um, this voltage regulator gets warm, this one does not. This one has voltage, this one has voltage, kind of. Uh, I need to look into that. But uh, anyway, I've ordered another one and I'll change it anyway. Might change them both. Um, and then we'll go from there. So, anyway, this is just a little video showing you what's coming up. I'm sure you're all very excited by the thought of some Texas Instruments stuff. But it's my first computer from a child. Um, 1983, I think I got one. There or thereabouts. So, anyway. This is the Text Instruments 299 and we'll be having a few videos on this in the future. So I'll see you later. Bye for now.